Getting up the train, Oxford Road, right here. Alright, let me go. Wait up. No checks today guys. You get out of Oxford like that, yeah? I'm not sure what's going on by like a lot of people today. Yeah? I'm back. I'm back. I'm back again. I 
back in Manny, Manchester. Yeah, today I will be showing you uh, more places here in Oxford Road. So. Okay, I'm going that way. I'm here, right, I'm here in Oxford streets but going up going further to Oxford Road. Yeah. You got the pub here. Today is the twenty seconds of May, uh Sunday. That's a building there called uh, an Oxford Road called Refuge Assurance Co. or something corporations. Yeah. Yeah, people, uh, make sure you like, subscribe. As the boys on you will show you always a lot of better places and best places as well, but it's not just it's authentic. So I'm not I'm not trying to lie to you. I'm not trying to keep it you know like a fake of stuff and that. But people sometimes try to keep it a bit fake and that, but not. Do you know what I mean? So make sure make sure make sure you like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Yeah. Starbucks. Oxford Road! Me here in. It's a holiday inn. A bit of history of Oxford Road, you know, if you don't know Oxford Road in Manchester, Oxford Road is known as a corridor, yeah, for the corridors, and also homes to uh, two universities, the BBC, British Broadcasting Corporations, and home, and home to a few uh, university places as well, and, and uh, gems, and something like that. So if you don't know, no, no, you know, guys. Bear uh, people right here selling stuff. German. That's a German thing right there. Chester Street, that's why you go through Chester Street, guys. If you don't know, no, no. Yeah? Home to a lot of universities, students. Yeah? Manchester Technology Centre. It's right there. It's like, if they ask you, they'll tell you number one area that where students, you know, foreign students have come here, is Manchester. Do you know, Manchester, Oxford Road. That's uh, where you find a lot of people, a lot of diverse people. Right there, students, uh, 
So let me just show you that the technology, technology center, Manchester Technology Center, just right there, and that's me. Yeah. Yeah, yes people. Make sure you like and subscribe because I show you only the best places that you want to know and things that you've never been before. You've probably been there, but I think you just need to know a little bit about the, the history of Oxford Road. Bless up, man. Yeah, bless up. Yeah, man, yeah. Yeah, so I, I just spoke to this gentleman right here in Manchester. Yeah. I think I think what I need to do, I need to cross over, man. I need to cross over the road, man. You get me? Oxford Road is known as the corridor, guys, or the corridors. That's what they call it. Oxford Road is the corridor. Why? Uh, and it's home to a lot of, you know, universities, Manchester universities. At Manchester Mo um, Metropolitan University, so just right there. Yeah? University of Manchester. Metropolitan University. Yeah, man. And a few, a few nice places, a lot of nice places, not just a few. If you like what you see, make sure you like and subscribe, man. Yeah? Like and subscribe. So I, I just, again, a, a little bit of history of this area, guys. Ma Manchester Oxford Road, known as a corridor, or, or, the, or the corridors, is home to two Manchester universities, or uh, universities. And uh, basically, it's not just two, two universities. There's a lot of universities, man. Just look at the shops right there, before I say it. Look at uh, the shopping area, boom. Boom, all the way up. Yeah? Yeah, it's right up there, and uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to go all the way up there so I can show you some other places, some pretty much nice places. <laughs> so that's the compass map. Yeah, this one here. What is say? The Corona Public Realm, Phase One, Oxford Road. You get the bus, you get the stagecoach. We stagecoach, yeah? Go all the way to, uh, you know, uh, probably Rush Home and, uh, and some other different areas and that. Do you know? Manchester, Oxford Road, guys. If you've never seen it before, uh, you want to come all the way from London and you want to know the area, this you'll come down. We're going to come all the way from Africa, Asia. Europe and that you know uh, Manchester Oxford Road what it looks like man yeah okay uh, what else do I need to say to you about Manchester really Oxford Road it's diverse you know uh, a lot of a lot of uh, people that from you know multi ethnic backgrounds people are different you know Different, different cultures in Manchester, different foods. You, you get to experience all that in uh, Manchester Oxford Road. So if you keep going further down, so as we go in, we're still in Manchester Oxford Road, guys. Do you know what I mean? And uh, I'm the boys on you right now. Make sure you like, subscribe, and let me know. Yeah. So this one here, There's a lot of centres, places that, you know, for the university students that to come and just around and walk around and go to experience as well. Like, I think you will never get bored as well, I think, in, uh, in Manchester, Oxford Road, because you always find a place, you always find an area. You what, you what, what I'm saying? Guys, you will never get bored of, of this area because there's always places that you can go to. 
like this, like this centre behind, like this centre behind you here, you always find a find a place that you can go to. Do you know? And yeah, it's, it's it looks really lovely and nice, man. Do you know what I mean? As we're coming here right now to the University of Manchester, boom, it's just right here. Yeah. What is this one here? That's Manchester RNCM. RNCM, just right there at the top. Just hold it, let me hold my camera just right at the top there, you find. Yeah. That's Manchester University, or the University of Manchester. Yeah? University of Manchester, right up here. So, they, basically, it's not known as that back in the, 18, uh, in the 1800 or 1884, or something like that. It was known as, uh, I think it was known as Victoria, was known as a mechanic institute, known as a lot of names. There's a lot of names, man, it's been changed a lot. So, Manchester. Yeah, yeah, so let me just cross over, guys, before I, before I tell you anything about this. There's another university, University of Manchester, boom. That is, that is crazy. That guy there is, is actually pissing right in the road. You can't be pissing right there, man. Right in the university, just pissing right there. It's, it's not nice. Oxford Road, Manny. Manchester. University. Hey. If you're coming, to, coming from the city centre, you need to get the 15. We need to get, to get 142 to come to Manchester University, guys. You know what I'm saying, yeah? Okay. You know what I'm talking about. This one here, the outpost, Manchester outpost. Some nice places for food, uh, cafes. which is nice, it's good for you. It's a blessing, 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 man. Wow, look at this area right there, brother. I think, I think uh, that's the reason why a lot of the students come around here and they, they see this area. I think they see this area and they'll, they'll be like, ah, you know what, you know what, it's actually Manchester's as good and diverse as a lovely area. Do you know I like it and that? Listen, uh, but you've never been you've never been in local areas. I think you won't, you won't really get to know exactly what's going on in this country. So you have to understand. But I'm showing this showing this area because uh, number one university for uh, foreign students right now, I think it has about maybe twenty thousand students that are foreign or more than that. That. It's Man the University of Manchester. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, look it up. Last time I've looked it up, they said about 20,000 or more than 30,000 foreign students actually uh, study every year in the University of Manchester. Yeah, in the University of Manchester, yeah, they do that. They do that here. So, it's very popular. You know, it's famous. It's famous for foreign students, foreign students overseas, for Asians, African, and a lot, a lot of people. You know what I mean? So, this this university right here behind me, this university right, is called the University of Manchester. Do you know? Yeah. Cafe, cafe views. Uh, this building, 
that's the museum. The Manchester Museum is also right here, just right behind it. Just right, right next to it as well. It's right, right next to it. The University of Manchester, just right behind you. And you've got the Manchester Museum, just right here. But, but it's closed right now, so you can't go anywhere. So you don't know what's going to happen. But yeah, it's closed. It should be open today, but like, you know, on Sunday, a lot of people might want to come over and visit here. Visit uh, the Manchester Museum. Manchester is closed right now. It's not open. That's me behind it, man. University of Manchester. Behind me right there, University of Manchester. And this right here is the Museum of Manchester. The Manchester U M Museum, that's what they call it. It's behind me, right behind me, man. Okay, let's go, let's go all the way up. It's just like, you know what I mean? I, so as, as, as you can see now, I'm gonna show you many, many places around here in Manchester. So just, you get to learn and experience, man. If you want to come on a weekend, yeah? We're still right here, we're still in the University of Manchester. Yeah? Boom, right there. We're still in the University of Manchester. There's many foreign students go inside. I don't want to go inside though. I don't want to go inside. I just want to go all the way up there. So, you know, many people are going to tell you, uh, you know, you know, I studied, I studied in the University of Manchester, bruv. Like people from like, you know, from all sort of life, yeah? Oh, I studied in the University of Manchester and I think it's really great and not nice and whatever. So, but what, what have you got to offer? for the nations. What have you got to offer? You studied in all these universities, but you haven't got nothing to offer. If you're from like Latin America, America, Asia, Africa, what have you got to offer? Explain, explain to the people, explain to them, and let them know, but you can't be saying that, so that's why you need to see these guys, you know, university, in Manchester, boom. And that's the streets. There's many compasses right there. That's a compass. Yes, yes. There's many compass right there, guys. So you get to see. Yeah. I'll just take you all the way up. So you get to know that. Yeah. You get to know this area. You get to know it. How you doing? You all right, yeah? So, like, you get to know a lot of places, so you look at the police right there, it's just waiting, I don't know what they're waiting for. All right, what is this here, what is this? Another pub. Yeah, that's a pub. Or a restaurant right here, people. No, the International Society. International Society. I don't know about that. I'm going to have to look it up later. You guys look it up as well, the International Society, yeah? Make sure you look it up. That's the Student Union, University of Manchester. The Student Union. Basically, it's, uh, it's been named, what's known as the Beco. Before that, they called it Beco, is not it? Is it Beco, Steve? Steve Beco? I think, I, I'm not sure, it's just you need to look it up. I think the student union this way in Manchester was known as, oh, oh, Steve Beco. Is it Steve Beco, the South African, yeah? The South African guy, Steve Beco, that's what they call it. Uh, well, it's called that way as well because the student union, they're all gathered together. I don't know, the, I, I have to get the story right, but I don't want to get it, I, I don't want to get it wrong now, but uh, uh, you're going to have to look it after, guys, yeah? Okay. Is that a church? Yeah, that, that's a church, man. The Student Union, University of Manchester, and some, some good places.
the Stockford. The Stockford. The Stockford building. I don't know what's the Stockford building because I'm not. I've never been a student anyway, so I don't know that. So you, you, you must let me know, guys. Okay. Quite lovely, you know. And that's me. This is known as the corridors. Or the corridor. Yeah? I'm going through Manchester Oxford Road. I'm still in Manchester Oxford Road. And uh, I'm just showing you all these areas. Man. And uh, where it is, it looks like. Make sure you like and subscribe and let me know. Do you know what I mean? So, the boys on G brings you the best I bring you the best I bring you the, I bring you the things that you've never seen you've probably seen it before if you're a student if you're a student here you've probably seen it before if you're not a student then uh, then you haven't seen it yeah you know I mean so you get to you get to see it you get to experience these areas yeah you probably know that you know what I mean so again I'm gonna say one one last time guys, make sure you like, subscribe and let me know. I want you to see all these areas. Yeah, Oxfam again, because everywhere you go you find Oxfam. Oxfam. A few shops. There's a, there's a lot of shops. Red chili. Of course, the coffee. Yeah. I'm going to show you the BBC the other side, but uh, probably the BBC Broadcasting House is just right there by, by uh, in Oxford Road as well, but, but the other side. So. Manny. I'm in Manny right now. Manny, 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 Manny. You know I'm in Manny, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. We've got the NHS car park right there. Yeah. These buildings right here is just like, they're not open at all. How you doing, you all right, yeah? Okay. Yes, Pete. these cafes there's a lot of look at look at the graffitis <laughs> graffitis and I, I don't think they're open these ones and these ones right here and still going through Manchester University the NHS foundation right there the NHS foundation yeah okay Manchester is diverse, is it or not? I'm not sure, you let me know. Okay, let me know. <laughs> yeah, so I... We're still going, going all the way up and then... Uh, This is Manchester, Sickle Cell. Sickle Cell. Yeah, yeah. 
centre. And that area, this place is, yes. The NHS Foundation, Manchester University. Just right here. Just to get some security so going over there. Right there, just I think. Okay. Make sure you like, subscribe and leave me a comment below. The boys on G, you know, walks about everywhere. We show you really authentic stuff, real stuff, no lies, no editing, nothing like that. Uh, because if you want to, you know, you, you make your mind up, you want to study in Manchester, Manchester, you want to come through Manchester Oxford Road, then you know that you're coming through that area. So that's why I'm showing you this area. Okay, boom, let's go. So I think I think we're approaching uh, Rusham or well, Rusham area. You know, Rusham area just right there behind. We're approaching. We're gonna go after that. Do you know what I mean? So as we're getting out of town, we're getting out of the city centre. Yeah, you'll be getting out of the city centre now in a few minutes. You get me? Uh, that's the park. Some, you see someone in the park right here. Who's that in the park there? Let me know, guys. Who's that guy? I'll probably come and tell you after, but who's that guy there? Do you know him? Do you know the guy? If you don't know him, let me, let me know if you know him. Leave it in the comment box below. We've got Portland and this area is City Laps. Yeah? Okay, family. You know, this is what they call it Manchester. Okay, family, this is what they call it Manchester. Oxford Road and some other area so from here see right there from up here that is Manchester Oxford Road look at the sign and this way uh, uh, another road which is safely that way you look at the sign and just up there it shows you that that's Oxford Road guys yeah so I'm gonna come back to you after Make sure you like, subscribe and let me know what you think about Manchester off the road. Is it nice? Is it good? What you think about, you know, the Manchester Museum? What you think about uh, the University of Manchester? Is it a good place to come? Is, is, is that area a bit diverse? So today's Sunday, 22nd of May, 2022. Make sure you like, subscribe and let me know. 360 for this area. Boom. That's me. Bless up.